Hello everybody, and a very warm welcome to LMT YouTube channel. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's decision to quit the royal family is one of the biggest scandals to hit the monarchy in recent memory. The couple announced their stunning decision at the beginning of January and are expected to make things official this spring. While there are plenty of reasons why Prince Harry decided to step down, the Duke of Sussex recently revealed the real reason he and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, left the royal family. Inside Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's exit. Taking to social media, Harry and Meghan announced their exit at the beginning of the year in what proved to be a shocking move for fans and the royals alike. The couple did not go into a lot of details about why they are stepping down, but they did reveal their plans for the coming months. The two are looking to establish a second home somewhere in North America and will no longer rely on public funds. They are also stepping back from all of their royal duties and will lose their HRH titles as a result. Meghan has remained very quiet in the wake of Mexit, though Prince Harry has opened up about the decision on two separate occasions. And during his most recent public engagement, Harry revealed the real reason why he and Meghan were forced to walk away. Why did the Sussexes leave the royal family? In what proved to be their first joint appearance since their announcement, Harry and Meghan recently attended a summit in Miami. According to the Express magazine, Prince Harry was one of the main speakers at the event, in which he talked about his mental health struggles that stem from his mother, Princess Diana's, tragic death. Eyewitnesses say that Harry opened up about his childhood and admitted that he still undergoes therapy to deal with the loss of his mom. He also revealed that living under constant pressure from the British press was something that he did not want Meghan and his son, Archie Harrison, to endure. He talked about how the events of his childhood affected him and that he has been talking to a mental health professional, a source shared. Harry also touched on Mexit, saying while it has been very difficult on him and Meghan, he does not regret their decision to step down as senior royals because he wants to protect his family. He does not want Meghan and their son Archie to go through what he did as a child. Considering everything Prince Harry experienced as a child, it is totally understandable that he would want to protect his wife and son from suffering the same fate. Meghan also reportedly shared a few words at the event. The former actress allegedly talked about her love for Harry and how much support he has given her over the past few years. Together, we recall the interview between RTV and Meghan. The Duchess of Sussex has revealed she has struggled privately to cope through pregnancy and the early stages of motherhood amid the pressures of press interest in her public life as a member of the royal family. For asking, because not many people have asked if I'm okay. But it's, uh, it's a very real thing to be going through behind the scenes. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle face new criticism. While it is good to know why Harry and Meghan really left the royal family, they are officially in the hot seat for attending the summit, which was sponsored by J.P. Morgan. Prince Harry and Meghan have been very supportive about raising awareness of climate change over the past two years. Yet showing up at an event funded by a company like J.P. Morgan has raised a lot of eyebrows in the environmental advocacy community. J.P. Morgan has come under fire in recent years for undertaking fracking in the Arctic. This goes against what Harry and Meghan have preached, especially when it comes to reducing fossil fuel emissions around the world. To make the situation even worse, Harry and Meghan were allegedly paid for speaking at the event. The couple reportedly took home between $500,000 to $1 million for attending the summit. How do Canadians feel about Mexit? Controversies aside, there is one country that absolutely loves the idea of Harry and Meghan leaving the royal family. Over the past few weeks, Harry and Meghan have been living in a rented house on Vancouver Island, 
and are reportedly looking to remain in the country. The two have a history in Canada, so it makes sense that they are spending time in the area. Meghan lived in Toronto while she worked on the show, Suits, while Harry has hosted an Invictus event in Canada in the past. In light of Prince Harry and Meghan's love for Canada, the High Commissioner of Canada to the UK, Janice Charette, recently opened up about the possibility of the Sussexes buying a home in the region. The most important thing is that they have selected Canada as a place they want to spend some time their family, she stated. We're all absolutely delighted because of that. They have moved, at least temporarily, to Canada. Another analysis. Everyone has been wondering about exactly what Prince Harry and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, planned to do after leaving the royal family. And even though they've been hiding out for the past few weeks, since announcing their intentions to step back as senior royals, there are a few clues that can help royal followers figure out how they're going to make money now. A lot of money. The past few weeks, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been enjoying a leisurely time in Canada doing yoga and taking long walks, plus spending quality time with their son, Archie Harrison. But soon, this couple will need to figure out how to keep making money to continue living the life they've become accustomed to. Here's what they could potentially do to make hundreds of millions. Public speaking engagements make perfect sense for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. It's widely believed that Harry and Meghan will have financial support from Prince Charles for at least a year following their departure as senior royals. However, even with their personal funds and the financial support of the Prince of Wales, they will need to start making money of their own soon. And based on their most recent moves, they might have a very smart strategy in mind. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex recently made an appearance in Miami at a J.P. Morgan summit, where Prince Harry discussed why he had to make the difficult decision to abandon his status as a working royal. What is speaking at the event could be all the answer we needed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex could make millions with public speaking engagements. It's unlikely that Meghan and Harry will launch a line with Target or start making nightclub appearances. But the idea that they might try to build their nest egg by attending profitable, meaningful speaking events just makes sense. The J.P. Morgan speech in Miami included plenty of wealthy audience members, including celebrities like Alex Rodriguez and Magic Johnson plus billionaire business tycoons. If the popular royal couple keeps up this strategy, PR professionals predict they could easily pull in more than $100 million this year alone. The former royals won't have to give up their extravagant lifestyle. Anyone who's worried about how Harry and Meghan will support themselves now, that they aren't financially carried by the royal family, is obviously underestimating their popularity. And if the couple sticks to worthwhile causes to make appearances, they won't even have to compromise their morals to do so. The Sussexes said during their announcement that they'd be splitting their time between the UK and North America going forward. But they didn't specify if they'd be in Canada, where they were when they made the announcement, or if they're house hunting in Los Angeles. Either way, they have plenty of opportunities to make money just showing up and talking about whatever they want. Will 2020 become the year of Meghan and Harry touring the world, sharing their wisdom with the world? We'll be watching to find out. So there you have it, that's all the news on Meghan and Prince Harry situation today. As always, thanks for listening. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and press that notification bell. If you want to be notified of future videos, Thank you. Don't stop.